Hello, Cédric Winters from Belgium. You wanted to know what we do during our two days voyage in the Soyuz vehicle towards the International Space Station and what type of food we eat on the space station. Well, during the two days that we travel with the Soyuz to the ISS, we actually have a lot of work. The first day before we launch, we are already working for nine hours to get ready and to prepare for the launch. And then after the launch, we still have to work another four hours to make sure that the vehicle is in a very good condition and that we can continue our flight. Then we go to bed. The next day, we have to prepare for our rendezvous and docking with the International Space Station. We have to make some special orbit burns in order to be in a good trajectory to join the International Space Station, but we also have to install several equipments in the Soyuz vehicle. So also there we are quite busy. And then the third day, from the moment we wake up, we are already busy with the rendezvous and docking for the International Space Station. And there the whole process takes about four to five hours. And until then we are docked and we can open up the hatch, it's another two hours. And then our work starts in the ISS. So even though it's two days, it's quite uh, a lot of work and it's quite, the time goes quite quickly. You also wanted to know what we eat in the International Space Station. Yes, indeed, we have very little fresh food. So mostly we eat out of cans or sublimates. Or we have some snacks, like this type of fruit that we can eat. The cans actually contain a full meal. This is actually uh, meat with vermicelli. So it's a kind of spaghetti. In a, in a can. This are mashed potatoes with onions. Here we just add warm water then we let it stand for about uh, half an hour or 15 minutes actually and then it's ready to eat. And candy of course we can just eat like this. But we also had a good uh, treat uh, just now because just a week ago a progress arrived and look what we have. In the progress they gave us some fresh apples. So of course they can't stay very long because we don't have a fridge, but at least a couple of weeks we have some fresh fruit to eat. So that's about it from the International Space Station. And here you see microgravity at work. Thank you very much for watching the ESA YouTube channel. Keep watching it and bye bye from now. Bye.